What's going on, you guys? Dallas Cowboy Football News. Guys, I just got done watching the All or Nothing series on Amazon Prime Video featuring the Dallas Cowboys. And that was an amazing eight-episode documentary of the Dallas Cowboys. It broke two games down each um, each video. And it just... It brought to life a lot of things, guys, and there was some clips going around, you know, saying Jason Garrett was doing it for the camera. Well, that clip, if you watch the whole thing, that was the only time Jason Garrett acted that way. Um, and uh, and right after that clip, a guy that got released, Orlando Skandrick, stepped up and he said, this is a result lead. If you don't step up, your ass will be without a job next year. And it, it highlighted everything that Cowboys talked about. Uh, Cowboy fans talked about, you know, the Des Bryant deal. And Des Bryant said in, in one of the episodes, he's like, I'm, when I have these outbursts, I'm fighting me. This has nothing to do with anybody except for me. So how you deal with you, I might deal with myself differently. And it, it just brought everything to life, guys, on this All or Nothing series. And this ain't a sponsor, guys, but if you have Amazon Prime Video, I suggest you watch these eight episodes. They're anywhere between 48 to 58 minutes long. Um, and it's just, you know, at, at the end, at the very last episode, you know, Jason Garrett said it, it was me of why we had this season. And if you don't take responsibility and look in the mirror and say what could I have done differently and he was addressing this to everybody you know and then the, the ending scene was as soon as that last meeting was done the one person that they had on camera watching film went straight to the linebackers room was Sean Lee guys and uh, during that Orlando rant Orlando Skagit rant he said he pointed at Sean Lee he was hurt during the time he said this motherfucker would love to put on a helmet right now and go, but he can't because he's injured. It's time to step up. And uh, and it, it was just an amazing documentary. And just seeing the behind the films of it, guys, if you got it, go watch it. Um, you know, it, to me, to explain the Jason uh, Garrett clapping, you, you know, because we don't get that, the real depth behind the scenes. And, that's, and this is what it gives you. Um, and uh, I'm not saying I'm a Garrett guy now, but it opened my eyes to a lot of things after watching these eight episodes. And uh, guys, watch it. If, you, if you've already watched it, let me know what you thought in the comment section, guys. And, and you know, if, if you're just a sometimer fan, it's not going to relate to you just because you're half-ass invested. And it's no knock on you, but like guys like, like me that are fully invested and live and breathe Dallas Cowboy football as fanatics this hits close to home and uh guys go check it out man it was amazing documentary on a nine and seven season um i, I wish you know i could have seen this thing with us holding a labarding trophy because it would have made it that much more but the drama and the distractions and the injuries everything we had last year it brings it to light and it just it just makes it that much more better, guys. So definitely go check it out. I give this documentary a, a, a plus plus a plus plus, guys. It's that good. And shout out to Amazon Films for doing this bad boy and uh, letting the fans see behind the scenes. And uh, go check it out, guys. This has been your Dallas Cowboy Football News. Remember, guys, if you watched it, drop some comments. Hit the like button if you're a true Cowboys fan. It's been your Dallas Cowboy Football News. Cowboy Nation, peace.